Are you confident? Uh, on the whole, yes. I can be confident and I can appear confident, but inside, not always. Not as much as I'd like to be. It's difficult to believe in yourself when your own body is chronically unreliable. Very confident. Do you care about what people think of you? Massively. <laughs> Only the people that I love, people that, that, that are particularly close to me, uh, their opinions matter. Yes and no. I care far too much about what people think about me. Again, sorry, it's a bit difficult, but I, I, do, I do care what people think about me. Uh, but equally, I've just learnt that everyone's got their own opinion and you can't please everyone. What is the first thing a stranger would think about you? Gay. <laughs> Most of the time, they assume I'm gay. Are you judgmental? I used to be, but I try not to be anymore. I try not to be, but I think it's human nature. Sometimes. I don't want to, but sometimes when I'm speaking, I discover myself saying something that I shouldn't, so... Do you think that the media are kind to men? I think the media is kind to men if you conform to what the average person thinks a man should be like. The media on the whole is very, very tough on men, particularly on the same men. The sooner you forget what the media tells you about what a man is, the better and happier you'll be. Think about the words you use to describe yourself. How does mainstream media portray those words? Uh, I mean, well, obviously, white British people get it easy. Um, but yeah, gay people, more, less so how they speak about gay people. What I notice more, especially in places like the Daily Mail, it's more about now how they talk about the trans community and they seem to be more of a punching bag than the gay people are. Stereotypical white male, I guess. Uh, I guess um, not quirky, not colourful, not uh, not different. The disability community is very, very diverse and very rich, and yet it's only one narrative of disability that we often see. In in the media, we are depicted as either being in need or being grateful for getting help. Uh, I don't feel identified at the moment with anything. That's a very good question. Uh, I don't know, I don't know why since I have memory, the stereotype of men is to be this figure of protection. I don't understand why media has just portrayed this image, which many men, cis men I know don't feel related. I, am, I guess we just need to open those spaces of or programs to, yeah, observe different men.